Ready for shop class? I am ready. Right on. Good instincts, but you want to tighten up the array. Uh, like this? Close. Here, I can show you. Uh, what's all the, uh, new equipment? Ah, oh, supplies? No need to thank me. Donated to the cause, courtesy of five Stark subsidiaries. Wow, that's... it's really something. Yeah, it's a bit of a mess, but just take what you need. I'll clear out the rest, I promise. Awesome. That's great. Did you know Tony planned to do this? No. Did you? Nope. Maybe he can tell us what's going on. Well, as a matter of fact, I... Huh. What is wrong? It's nothing. How's it going, boss? Ready to get your hands greasy? Tony, why did you bring all this equipment? Really? The old stuff has a junkyard horked up in an 80s machine shop vibe. Why, were we supposed to vote on it? Do not worry about me. Robbie, huh? He's usually so laid back. I didn't think he'd have a problem. I cannot speak for him. The two of you should work it out. All right, I'll fix it. So about this situation, I get it. We're bumping elbows. But you kids are doing good work here. Whatever you want to do, I'll support it. I spoke with Tony about the equipment. He says he wanted to support shop class. That's all? He believes he is helping. That is good enough for me. Yeah, that's what I figured. Look. You came here to make something. Don't keep Parker waiting. I guess I'll keep an eye on Tony. Make sure he doesn't do any crazy rich people stuff. Like what? We don't want to find a champagne waterfall in the break room, you know? Actually, that would be tight. Glad you cleared that up with Tony. Now we can get to work. So, the Hulk. You designed a prototype that will defeat him? No. Then what about the Hulk? We don't know if any of this is going to work. But in theory, and I have to stress the theory, we think we can keep you alive for six seconds more than Central's models project. Maybe seven. We should just build it. That's what I like to hear. I have the components you gave me. Always good to get ahead. I'm ready to put this together. How about you? I am ready. And that's a decent prototype. Just needs refinement before you bring it to market. You plan to sell it? It's only an expression. Although... Nope, stopping right there. Let me know when you're ready to take off. I am ready to go. That is good work. Uh, thanks. Did the new equipment help?
I've squared off against Hulk a lot of times over the years. None of them are pretty. Dr. Banner used to be the upside to the Hulk. Oh, you are gonna love this. Ah, yeah. Got more coil for me? Sometimes, I even impress myself. Strange knows Merlin. My lucky day, huh? Let's do it. See you around. After seeing Banner's soul twisted under Lilith's control, I see why Bruce used to doubt himself so much. He mistrusts the green brute because deep inside, Banner doesn't trust himself. Another thing he and I have in common. There is still hope for Banner. Yes, there is always hope. But do you think it's possible I'll ever see Bruce Banner in the same way ever again? Whenever we face Banner next, we owe it to ourselves and to him to not hold back. We will have to face him soon, won't we? I want to be ready when I do. I want to be sure of myself. You are not alone, Wanda. When the time comes, we will face your demons, our demons, together. Thank you, Hunter. That gives me some strength. Did I ever tell you about the time a Hulk tore me in half? This sounds like a story I cannot pass up. I was in the path of a Category 5 Hulk smash storm. Big Green pulled me apart like it was wing night at his favorite pub, and I was the chicken. Well, that sounds absolutely horrible. Then Hulk threw my legs four miles away from the rest of me. What? up a snow-covered mountain. Had to claw my way to him. How did you survive? That lovely, forceful bisection put my healing factor to the test. Had to find my legs by their scent. My scent, if you catch my drift. As long as Lilith controls the Hulk, we are at a disadvantage. Yep, and we're sorely lacking in the Hulk killer department. I volunteer you, Wolverine. We all know what's gonna happen, Hunter. Doesn't mean I gotta be eager about it. Well, no matter what, we are sorely lacking in the Hulk killer department. Anytime someone wants my opinion, it means we're really screwed. Remind me not to brainstorm with you anymore. Makes sense. I'm more of a claws out kind of guy. Anyway, glad you enjoyed our little Hulk survivors group. We'll meet again if we survive him next time. Hi, hi, Hunter. 
Hello. Do this. Don't stress it. All right, then. Nice to get some fresh air. Ready to work? out of trouble.
You're not far from a Hydra data drop used by their field operatives. A potentially valuable source of new intel on their movements. Whoever in service, no one will touch you. They have not lost interest. Carol's script on those consoles, it will do the hard work for us. Assuming we can keep Hydra from blowing up the server first. Got it, boss. be of great help. This should be good. What are the qualifications to be a Hydra officer? I have guessed a warm body, but I think Lilith solved that too. You are lucky to still be breathing.
see you brought some friends along. Anyway, it can't be enough. was your one chance. That's not right. What's our concussion protocol like? Is that a call for reinforcements? We are immovable. More than protect us. Are they stronger than they look, at least? I'm going... They're not going to like this. You can thank me later. I don't know what it is, but I like it.
Quirks make a move yet? The battlefield is ours. It hit me with the stun. Oh, I thought we were finished. We stand with the mother. Over the years, Lilith's disciples have come in many forms. No time for good cop, bad cop. thing is pretty stale. Got any new material? Hydra's standards have fallen a great deal. building one of those suits for me. Recruit and await reinforcements. You should have brought more help. You've recovered the data. Excellent work out there. She's not ready. We ask for too much of her sometimes. I don't want to make her do anything she's not ready for either. But we all know she's the only one who can face him. Is there anyone else here who has the power to do it? Nico, you're a badass blood witch. What about you? 
I might not be packing as much firepower in the magic department as we're gonna need. Hate to say it, but she is more powerful than me. Like, way more powerful. Plus, she knows what we're dealing with firsthand. It's gotta be her. What if she doesn't want to? We shouldn't make her. Then one of us needs to convince her. I'll speak to her. When the time is right. If you think she's up to it, we will see. So, is it settled? Meeting over? Yes, Robbie. You're excused. You can go back to playing video games. <laughs> Rad! Because I'm about this close to finally leveling up. Bet you cannot do it before Kathon eats your controller. Oh, you know what, Magic? You're on. Que pasa, Hunter? Well, crap. Yes, hello. Lilith can keep throwing demons at us. We'll keep putting them down. I admire how you have made your own family here. Whoa, thank you. You're the best. What is the deal with you and Tony? He's gone too far. I'm not backing down until I get an apology. I meant in general. What are you talking about? He walked out of the bathroom holding my shampoo. He just handed it to me and said, thanks. So? So he never asked to borrow it. You could always take his soap, see how he likes it. I'm not looking for payback, just an apology. Oh. Yeah, Tony escalates when you push him. We grouse at each other, but Tony and Banner, they fight. Can't wait till next time. Lovecraft, Crowley, Transcendental Magic, Conquest Through Technology and Mysticism by Victor Von Doom. <laughs> Guessing this library doesn't carry the Hardy Boys. I am unfamiliar with their work. I brought you here, Hunter, so we might reconnect with your roots. To remind you of who you are, where you came from, and where you can go. And, more importantly, who I believe you can become. Okay, so where do you see me going, Steve? Not to sound like a self-help book, Hunter, but sometimes it's more about the journey than the destination. Keep striving to be the best version of the Hunter you can be. If you keep doing the work, nothing will be out of your reach. Except for that row of encyclopedias at the top of that bookshelf. I'm pretty sure you're gonna need a ladder for that. gonna love this. Alright, 
let's get so how's the whole saving the world thing going uh give me a sec okay what's up This is some of my best work. Big Tony's Forge of Mystery, we never close. Farewell. some friendly advice, and you're pretty okay at both the friend and the advice part. Are you ready? I am ready. <sighs> okay, I think that you think that I'm one of those good people, right? Not Marvel America levels, but not too far off. But where do you stand on the nature versus nurture question? I rather judge a person based on who they are, not the path that brought them here. Okay, fine. But how do you know if your judging is right? There's tons of stuff in both my nature and nurture that screams evil. How can you be sure that I'm not, you know, evil? Maybe there is a bit of darkness in you, but what is wrong with that? How about plenty wrong with that? What if it isn't a little? What if I'm the next Dark Mage of the Minora Clan? In that case, I will get to say I knew you before you were famous. <laughs> I don't know, Hunter. I feel like I'm holding myself back worrying about this stuff. You've been around me enough, and I kind of trust you. What do you think? I think that if you want to reach your true potential, you need to come to terms with your past. Okay. How? Do not be ashamed of it. Your history is part of your makeup. Embrace it. Just like that? Yes, just like that. Accept it, and do not let anybody hold it against you. Not even yourself. Hmm. That's maybe a good idea. A strong maybe. Okay. I think I might have a plan now. Feel better? Not yet, but I will. Day, huh? Let's do it. All right, then. <laughs> 